Tensions are high in Peterborough today where a white supremacist rally was set to get underway here inside Confederation Square. The organizers of that rally weren't granted a city permit, but they said they would still show up. Well, that sparked some counter rallies with local residents here and people traveling from as far as Toronto. Okay, I escorting one man who came face to face with the crowd who ripped his poster and were chanting for him to leave. The head of the Canadian Nationalist Front, Kevin Goudreau, had said that regardless of a lack of permit, the event was still a go and 20 to 50 people would be showing up. Late this afternoon, he tweeted saying he couldn't in good conscience hold the event due to public safety. Those kind of protesting say a hate-filled rally like this shouldn't be allowed in Canada. That's taught. That spreads over and, and, and those individuals, either they have children or they have nieces or nephews or they know younger, the younger generation and they spread that vitriol. And that vitriol and that hatred then becomes part of the younger generation. That's the problem. If they showed up, they showed up. If they didn't show up, they didn't show up. What happened today shows that the community at a whole in Peterborough came together to fight against oppressiveness and to fight against racism. The local police here at one moment took one person to the back of the cruiser. That person was later released at the scene after a massive crowd surrounded that police vehicle. An officer here at the scene tells me that investigation is still ongoing.